Hi, I'm going to present some tips on jazz improvisation and some composition tips. Uh, it's been an integral part of my life. So let's get started with the first tip slash lesson. The first lesson or tip is uh, based on an original piece that I wrote, but it's based also on the style of Errol Gardner, which is a constant left hand. He plays some of his pieces, Misty, and many others. And the left hand keeps constant while you have your melody above. So on this piece, I have a B minor 7th, G 7th, A minor 7th, A 7th, uh, in inversion so that it becomes closed harmony. For instance, your left hand plays. Make your melody. That's how you would approach having some fun and applying it to different keys, maybe different pieces of music. Uh, so that's the crux of our first lesson. And what I did, uh, I made a variation with my right hand, same melody, but I used a little cluster chording, such as sounding. As you can see, there's a lot to be done. You can, as I said, you put it in different keys, uh, change your melody around, octaves, little cluster in your right hand, and what you come up with is your own jazz piece and have fun with it. Again, thanks. Uh, hope to see you again. And I'll include next time jazz tips slash lessons on original jazz and maybe some stuff.